Hi dancers. So I want to bring your attention to the spine. There are three regions of the spine and three curves of the spine. In ballet, we stand up very upright and we do lengthen our spine. However, you don't want to eliminate the curves of your spine because the curves of your spine are like a spring. So when you jump, your, the curves actually compress a little bit and lengthen a little bit to help ease the impact of your jumping. So it's really important that we don't eliminate the curves of our spine. Your spinal regions are the cervical spine, so the seven vertebrae in your neck. And you can go ahead and palpate in below your skull and see if you can feel the little bony protuberances of each of those vertebrae. And if you let your chin drop, you can start to roll down vertebrae by vertebrae through the seven cervical vertebrae. So your cervical spine has a curve, an inward curve. And then your thoracic spine is the next region, the region through your mid-back. And there are 12 thoracic vertebrae. So the curve of your thoracic spine goes the opposite direction. Cervical spine curves inward and the thoracic spine curves outward. Mine is quite pronounced, so you can see my, my thoracic curve is quite pronounced. Um, you can palpate a little bit coming down from your cervical spine and try to palpate, see if you can feel the bony protuberances of each individual vertebrae. And those come all the way down to your low back, which is your lumbar spine. So in your lumbar spine, you have five vertebrae. And, the, and again, the curve reverses. So there's an inward scooping curve in your lumbar spine. And you can feel that curving inward right here above your sacrum. So again, we have the cervical curve, the thoracic curve, and the lumbar curve. And then you have the sacrum, the sacred bone, and the coccyx, which has its own curve. So those are the regions of the spine and sit, try it sitting in a chair and just rolling down letting your chin drop and imagine that each vertebrae is like a block and you're pushing the block off the stack one block at a time and let your head roll down through your seven cervical vertebrae and then start to roll down through your thoracic vertebrae and feel your spine curve all the way forward. Then roll up, stacking your spine like blocks from the bottom to the top, lumbar vertebrae, thoracic vertebrae, and finally cervical. So those are the regions of the spine. Cervical is your neck, thoracic is your mid-back, and lumbar is your low back.